talked about the fact that forgiveness is something that God does and that we've grown up in a system most of our lives thinking that God expects us to forgive other people. And if we don't, then he won't forgive us. Mm -hmm. Well, that's not true. And so that's what the sermon's about. Real forgiveness is not that God was mad at us and then he got over it and then he decided that he wouldn't punish us because he got over his anger. True forgiveness is that God never connected us to our actions. He didn't say that who we were was based on what we did. He sees us apart from our actions and he sees us blameless and holy and just like himself. So forgiveness is actually the separating of a person from their actions so that the union of the two is utterly destroyed. Hmm. So now apply that to the cross. The separation right. of what is killing We're us, moving. separating us from divorcing us, divorcing Romans 7, us, right. Romans 7, divorcing us from the belief system that was killing us and destroying us and utterly destroying it. And the belief system that we were in was that our actions did say who we were. We were judged, we judged ourselves by our actions. Mm. We thought God judged us by our actions. We judge everyone else by their we, actions. We judge everybody else by their actions. When God is saying, he, he showed me that he just did so neat because so many people are painting right now. But I'm not one of them. But anyway, <laughs> God is. God is painting this beautiful picture of man. So that we can see it. And he's saying, the man that I created, my man, is holy and blameless and innocent. And that's the way he's always been. And when there are any actions that are manifest from his members that don't line up with my life, it's only because, and I'm going to preach that this coming Sunday, it's only because he's forgotten who he is. He's forgotten that he's holy and blameless and innocent. He's forgotten what type of a man he is. Yes. Right? Yeah. Walk away, forgotten what type of a man mm -hmm. he is. 